Hi, it's Candice from Candice's Book Blog, and it's time for another in my mailbox. I got a lot of books this week. Um, first of all, Michelle Hopkins sent me um, a bunch of Mara Dyer bookmarks, and they are signed. So, and that was from uh, her contest. Uh, when you, if you bought her book, then you were entered in a contest to win an iPad. I did not win an iPad, but I did win some bookmarks. So thank you for Michelle. Thank you to Michelle for those. And then yesterday I went to the used bookstore and I did some trades. Um, I tried in some of my old books, mostly some adult books that I had got somewhere and didn't really care about keeping. And I got twenty-six dollars in credit, and so um, I spent some of it on. North of Beautiful. This is by Justina Chen Heatley. Not sure if I pronounced your name right. Um, I actually started reading this. I'm about halfway. Yeah, about halfway. And it is really, really, really good. It's kind of blowing my mind. I really love it. And then I got Going Too Far. And I actually had borrowed this book from Lori at Pure Imagination, and I then when I saw this copy and I noticed that it's like in perfect condition, I figured I would get it for a giveaway. So that will be a giveaway um, one of these days, real soon. I also got Academy 7 by Anne Osterlund, and um, I read Aurelia. And I really liked it. And this is her new, I want to say new series. I think it's like going to be a series. And then the last one that I got, it was Leaving Paradise by Simone Eccles. And I, I didn't know for sure if this was like the first in a series. Actually, I thought it was the second in a series when I got it. And I was figuring... Um, I could see how much the first one was or something. Anyways, I'm kind of an idiot because I know that I knew that this really is the first one in the series and there's only two books in the series. And I read some reviews and it looks like this one is really good. So I'm going to be reading that one hopefully this month. And then I bought some books because I got a gift card. And so actually this one I didn't use my gift card with. This was a random buy at Walmart. It is The Dark Elite by Chloe Neal. This is the first two books in the Dark Elite series, uh, Firespell and Hexbound. And one reason I really wanted to have it is because Lori from Pure Imagination is quoted in it. So that's really cool. Plus it has a better cover, I think, than Firespell and Hexbound. They're really tiny books and um, they kind of get lost on your shelf. So I never did buy them, so I'm glad that it came out in a bind up. And then I got Amplified by Tara Kelly. This, um, I already read this and it was amazing. I really, really liked it. And then with my gift card, these next, these next few I got. Drink Slay Love by Sarah Beth Durst. And I've read some amazing reviews for that one. Witchlanders by Lena Coakley. I read some really good reviews and I love the cover and it sounds amazing. Bloodborne by Karen Kinsey. Um, I really liked Other, which is the first book there, companion novel, so you don't necessarily have to be read in order, but I haven't read this yet, so don't quote me on that. They probably should be read in order just because the first one kind of sets it up in a way. Um, I think. Anyways. And then another one that I got. I just realized that one of the books that I ordered didn't come yet. Uh, Skyship Academy. The Pearl Wars. This is by Nick James. And I guess I'm going to assume this is the first in a series. I mean, I know it's not. I know it's the first, but I don't know if it's a series for sure. Anyways, um. I've been wanting it since it came out. So I'm really looking forward to reading that one. 
and I bought witch eyes, but I guess it hasn't come yet, so I guess that'll be in next week's. Hopefully, hopefully it'll come. Um, and then I got one book that is considered for review, but it's actually my second copy. It is Hallowed by Cynthia Hand. This is the second book in the series. Um, last week or the week before, I had gotten this as well. So this is going in the giveaway pile, and I have my blog anniversary coming up, so I'll probably give it away then, or maybe before then. We'll see. And that is everything that I had in my mailbox this week. So what was in your mailbox?